<laughs> my man Kev posted this, man. It took me back. We really used to do that. Like, I remember when I got, I was 15, 16, I got my work permit. I would go to the shopping center in my house that had like Subway, Burger King, Taco Bell, Albertsons, like all the spots. And then I would go to the mall and I was just walking around with my pen in my pocket, asking each place, you know, hey, are, are y'all hiring? Now, if they said no, but we taking applications, I'd be like, man, fuck out of here. Cause I'm not, you not hiring me. Like you not hiring me. But the ones who was like, yes, we are. I would take it and go fill it out right then and there in front of them so they could see like, oh, he really, he really wants this. He's a hard worker, you know? <laughs> not knowing that like, nigga, I just want some money real quick, right? And then uh, <laughs> I remember like, that's how I learned my social security number. I was filling out so many job applications. I memorized it because you just doing the same thing in repetition over and over and over and over. And then I remember how nervous I was trying to get that first one. You know what I mean? When you're trying to get that first one, you get the interview. You know, you know, I remember my interview, <laughs> my interview outfit used to be, I had this uh, like FUBU vest. <laughs> it was like white, blue, and black. I used to wear that vest to every single job interview. You feel me? And then I finally got a job at Burger King, right? I worked at Burger King. And then after you get them first jobs, though, then you get kind of arrogant, right? And the more you, you like, you start looking for other ones, you'd be like, you ain't tripping no more in the interviews. You ain't tripping no more off the job applications because you got that work experience, you know, in the little spot where you put up work experience. You feel it out like, yeah, I've been here. I've been here. I've worked for this long. Then they hit you with the, you know, oh, why did you quit? You know, oh, you got to make up some lie or some shit. You know what I'm saying? I remember the most arrogant I ever was was when I went to work uh, for In-N-Out because it was a new, it was new and it was hiring hell of people. But they was like looking for like uh, people who could work uh, the weekends. And you had to be over 18 at the time I was in college. So we was like, we good there. And in and out has a big basketball tournament every single year. So we didn't know that at the time. But so they, they look for athletes. So me and my teammates went in there to get the job. They was like, wait, all, all you guys, uh, you guys play for the college? We were like, yeah, they were like, great. That was the whole interview. All we talked about was hoop. And they was like, so you guys, you play, right? Okay, cool. Okay, yeah, all right, we're calling. Like, we knew when we walked away, we're like, we got this job. And sure enough, they hired me and three of my teammates. We won that tournament, by the way. We blew everybody out by, like, 20, 30. It, was, it wasn't even close. But, uh, yeah, this, was, this, this brought back a lot of memories, man. Because everything's online now. You know what I'm saying? Everything's online. But back in the day, we used, we used to go place to place with the pen. Are y'all hiring? That's how we made our little money. <laughs>